Hey guys, just found a container here that's condensating in our yard. I'd like to go through why that happens and what you can do to mitigate this. Stay tuned. I'm Channing McCorson, the container guy. In this quick video, I'm gonna show you why you need ventilation, especially if you're storing things like cardboard boxes, stuff that you do not want your container raining on. So it's four degrees Celsius outside. Uh, it's pretty chilly. Uh, it's fluctuating from freezing temperatures at night to uh, above freezing during the day. And so now if we look up at the corrugations on the roof here, you can see on all the lower corrugations, there is water pooling, puddling and dripping. And so that water is dripping down on the floor and you can see there's just, there's lines with this water is dripping. And so if you're storing something like cardboard boxes in here uh, that you don't want to get wet, they would be getting wet. And so this is the condensation that we talk about. This is the reason why you need big air 45 vents installed in containers to make sure that you're exchanging the air. You don't have uh, the interior of this can be 20, 20 degrees going in tonight and then it's minus, uh, 10 at night and that huge temperature swing is what causes this condensation and causes the drippage. So to continually be exchanging the air and keeping the air inside your can the same temperature or close to the same temperature as the air outside of the can, that's going to definitely help that and reduce the condensation in your storage container.